Okay, so I've got a 5 16th end mill in uh, the mill drill, and I've got uh, our uh, internal collar um, placed in uh, the good vise. Uh, this vise is overkill. You could really clamp it to uh, the bed of the mill, but I had it in place, so I'm using it. I've got a couple of parallels supporting it. Uh, because I need uh, 3 8 inch keyway, and I'm using a 5 16 inch uh, end mill, which is what I had quickly available. Actually, it's better practice than using a 3 8 inch because that might wear down uh, to a narrow diameter. But again, this is you know something that you can really do with just a drill bit and a file. You know, we're close enough. I'll go make one pass through, and then I'll open it up a little bit uh, on either side. So again, this is a little bit overkill, but uh, if you got the tools, you might as well use them, right? Okay, so we got a nice fit. So we'll cut, do the final fitting, and uh, then weld the assembly together, and we'll have our internal keyway. So for all the detailed instructions on how to build the Homestead Grain Mill, go to EnduringTechnologyPress.com. And again, uh, it's geared for uh, being able to construct it with uh, simple hand tools like a uh, 3 8 inch hand drill, an angle grinder, and a MIG welder or other welding equipment. That's all you need. If you've got fancier equipment, you'll be able to turn it out that much faster. Thanks.